Hi traders, just the first three minutes into the trading day and look at Kara. Kara is up 16%. Beautiful daily. Here comes the intraday. The highs is 2105. I want to go long at the highs. Assume it's going to go over now. 4,000 shares and it did go over. Good. Now let's see a quick first partial here. Good. 20 cents. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go Kara. 30 cents. Getting ready for my partial. I'm going to cover 3600 shares. Missed my chance. <laughs> I'll have to go through a pullback now. I'll have to go through a pullback. It still looks good, but it looks like I'm going to have to look for a pullback. And ANF is at the lows. I'm about to short shorting now. ANF is down 21%. It looks great. Just shorted at the lows. Hoping it's going to get under. The lows is 1956. And at that point, it seems to me like it's probably going to continue lower. Here we go at the lows now, getting close. Now, the nice thing about it, as you can see, it's a huge gap down and it tried to move higher and it failed. That's exactly the pattern I'm looking for. Good. Adding now, adding another 2000 shares, just added because it moved under the lows. Kera is holding at the breakout point. I'm going to reduce my size at a small loss. I have 4,000 shares. I'm going to reduce now. Reduced at about a 10 cent loss, 2,000 shares. So I'm a little bit down on Kera, but uh, you know, I missed the first opportunity. I have to reduce my size. ANF came down under the loss. And look at that. What a beautiful continuation here. Beautiful continuation, more than 50 cents, about to take my partial at any sign of pullback. Look at the seller side. If they pull back up over 1910 now, just moved up to 1913. I saw this first sign of a pullback and and I took my partial. There's no reason to hold on when you see a pullback. I've got a great partial in ANF. Carries back to the highs. I only have 2000 shares left. Earlier I had 4,000, reduced my size because it wasn't doing much. I didn't want to take the risk. And now it's back to the highs. I'm getting ready for a partial. Now, took 1,800 shares. That was a nice partial. Well, my two trades are in green, but a very small green trade in care. CPRI is trending lower. And I want to short it right around here. About to short, just small size, 1,000 shares, short now. Well, I'm, I'm playing with the trend here. It's a very, very clear trend, nice downside momentum, and I expect it to continue. CPRI so far did not break down under the lows at 34.95, and now it's even pulling back up a little bit. My stop should be at around 35.35, somewhere around here. But I'm not moving out on spikes. And it just touched the point where I should have moved out. But again, I never move out on spikes. This green candle you're seeing right now is a spike. This could be a fat finger. Somebody's buying, somebody's, you know, just being afraid, clicking the button with large quantities. You always have to wait for the first sign of a break. And this is right now. Look at this red candle you're seeing now, the start of the red candle. I'm actually going to add a bit. I'm short 1,000 shares. I'm about to add another 1,000, adding now. Just added a bit because I see the first sign of a pullback. We also have the view up right over here. So that should be resistance. And the first spike, spike up, really cooled down a little bit. I mean, when you see the first spike, when you see this, the price moving higher, and that is, of course, uh, opposite the size that I was, I was shorting the stock. And then you wait for it to come down a little bit. And this small red candle is the first sign of the stock calming down and I could add a bit more. NF is doing great and seems like it's about to make another leg down. So I want to add, and again, very small size, adding now. Well, missed it now. 1,000 shares. Just added to NF. And again, a small size that will not risk my first trade in NF. Never risk the first good trade you had. Just added. 1,000 shares. 
ALF is doing good, just broke down under the lows. I'm getting ready for my partial. Here we go. Any sign of a pullback? Now, took my partial, left 300 shares. Had earlier 200 shares. Now, took my partial on the 1000 shares I added earlier, but just 900, so I'm leaving 300 to go. I love the momentum in Goose. Stock Scott took it earlier, somewhere around here. That was a huge trade and still holding it. And I am about to join this trade after under 38. And now, well, moved slightly under 38. I just took 1,000 shares. I have approximately 50 cents stop loss and 50 cent target. Hope it's going to continue with the trend. CPRI finally at the lows, under the lows, finally came under 34.95. Remember this spike up here? I'm about to take my partial right here. Now, took my partial. And again, remember this spike here. Never move out on a spike. Never move out. I added and it worked great. Goose is finally back to the lows and under. And uh, it's at around the 50 cent uh, target. Well, not quite. Taking now. Well, I want to put it behind me. It's a very risky trade. I'm happy with what I have. Have a nice partial in Goose. 10.08, just 38 minutes into the trading day and I've got all green trades. NF with over 3 grand and look at the rest. I also have GPN from yesterday, but that doesn't count the $480 there. Up $4,800. What a great day. Thank you for watching our video. Before you go, we invite you to take Tradenet's free welcome course. It was designed to teach you the basics of Wall Street trading. Click here to sign up for this no risk, no cost offer. If you like this video, please subscribe to our YouTube channel where you can view many more stock trading videos. Questions or comments, please submit them below.